Hello everyone. Um, please excuse me being in the bathroom. Uh, my daughter's sleeping in the bedroom next right out there, so I didn't want to be away from her. So please just ignore all this, please. Um, but anyway, back to the vlog. I'm gonna answer a couple of questions for this week. Uh, question number one: What are your initial thoughts about brainstorming? Um, I honestly thought brainstorming was just about throwing out ideas and thoughts at the wall and seeing what sticks originally. But after going through all the material and going through the stages and the process, I really like the brainstorming part the most. You're encouraged to go crazy with your ideas and embrace as many as possible. I also like how brainstorming takes a lot of strategy to it as well, which I didn't know, and I definitely took that for granted in the beginning. Um, also, with the group brainstorming, it gives you a better chance of making a great idea. Individuals can create amazing ideas by themselves, but in a group setting, you can come up with the best ones, in my opinion, because um, you have multiple brains that cover different perspectives and different channel of thought, and just the thought process is just, each, everyone's different. So everyone has their own little unique take on it. So I can really put an idea over the top if you combine. All right. Question number two, what was the good or bad about, what was good or bad about brainstorming experience? I'll start with the bad first. The bad is that there can be too many ideas where it causes chaos. Also, many ideas get overlooked and or forgotten because people remember the most recent thoughts and ideas more often. Um, so that's pretty much the bad. Um, the good is that it's a great way to have, like it's a great to have so many different perspectives. Um, and it helps you see things you didn't even thought was possible, and end up being pure genius. Um, the good is that there's a lot of great ideas, and great ideas need to be kind of combined or recombined um, to make them work like in a collaborative style, which I mean in this case is perfect because I had the best group mates to like actually collaborate together because we really we built each other up. Um, also, brainstorming is fun because you throw all sorts of crazy wacky ideas out there. And it just might be crazy enough to work. I also like the brainstorming process with my group. Um, as I said earlier, we built each other up. Um, all, our, all of our ideas had an unexpected touch. And in this case, it worked very well for my group because how respectable everyone was. Um, and the final question, what would you do differently next time? Um, next time around, I would like to remember all the first ideas um, that me and my group had. Um, I believe that we had too many too quickly to really gather every single thought we had. Um, so I regret doing that. I definitely would collect everything next time around. Um, I also would like to uh, group and categorize all our ideas them in an earlier stage of our um, in our design thinking, um, just to keep us more organized. Um, not that we weren't organized, but we could have been more efficient. I feel so categorizing definitely would have helped. Um, I also would have liked to think about the prototype more when we were originating our ideas. So maybe we could have made more realistic realistic ideas or something possibly that we didn't think of could have popped up and helped make our pamper pack even stronger. Um, so yeah, those those are the things that I probably would have done differently. But yeah, I thought my, me and my group, we did really well. Everyone did their part and it was it was a good, it was a great brainstorming project for us. So yeah, it was nice. And um, that'll conclude my vlog. Thank you.